Those odds on triple stack Bowser are insane. Usually people don't gamba so high, but here we are. All right, looking at it, seems that Raphael is finally catching up. He wants to get number one before this guy has a chance to catch up. However, he hasn't played in a few days, or rather hasn't played Super Expert in a few days. So I think he's fine. Once Raphael catches up, he said he's gonna take a break and play Tears of the Kingdom. I don't know what the rest of the people are doing. I think Hoopa's catching up. And Shoshe, that's about it. Oh look, he changed his name back. He really just does, he just he really just wants attention. He really does. How about that? No, oh, looks like my chat box is broken again. I don't know what causes that with 7TV's chat box now. But I'll fix it real quick. Let's take a quick refresh and it's easily fixed. What are triple stack Bowsers? Basically, you know what? I guess for the sake of it, let me show you. It's easier to show them to say it, because even if you say it, it doesn't quite make full sense, because you can do something like this, and you think, oh, this is a triple stack Bowser. No, you have to actually attach them. This is a triple stack Bowser. That is what a triple stack Bowser is. However, in 3D World, oh, that's not 3D World, that's new soup. I gotta wait for this. I mean, that's a triple stack Bowser. But... In 3D World, it's, if I get my cursor over there, there isn't a thing as stacked enemies in this mode. However, I have dictated that the ruling for triple stack Meowser is if you see... Wherever he's at. If I see this off of the corner of my screen, I will count that. If I see this go flying down in the pit or something, I will count that. Because it's just funny that they tried to attach it. And that is what a triple stack Bowser is for the prediction. Alright, let me get my skips counter out and then we'll play. Think we're good? Yeah, I think we're good. Alright. And apparently the chat box is breaking again. Why? Why is it doing that? I don't understand why the badges are breaking. Yeah, no, they're completely broken. That's crazy. Let me go log into 7 uh, TB real quick. What the heck is this button? Oh, I can migrate all my better Twitch TV to 7 TV. Very interesting. I'm good on that. I logged in. I don't think anything's going to change. It better didn't work. It didn't work. I guess we're going to live without badges today. Kind of weird, but eh, it's going to have to happen. Sorry, guys. Let's go. I mean, I can reset the prediction if you guys want. If for some reason you didn't know about the triple Meowser thing, which is... Extremely rare, and I know exactly one creator that does it. I can reset it if you want it that bad. I'm just letting everyone know, not just you, uh, Bexpy. Just so you know. <laughs> we have one already, yeah. Look, it has to be an endless, and it has to be within endless, not out of endless for it to count. Why is there so many time attacks in a row? What the heck? How often do I see triple stack Bowsers or Meowsers? Triple stack Bowsers is like 1 in 100 clears usually. That's what I usually see. Uh, probably not a good warm-up level, honestly. Yeah. Oh, I actually could have gone in the vine there. Hmm. Maybe one more try. If I die, I have to move on. I have ideas, but... Pretty brutal of a level. Or I guess we could just do this. We just beat it on the next go. Uh, Solomon, 
One in 100 for clears for a triple stack Bowser is including all the skips I do too, just so you know. I'm surprised there are as many yeses compared to as many noes. It should be very low chance. I don't know why people are... So, if you want to lose your channel points, there you go, but... There you go. I'm, I'm glad someone had some sense to hit no. Because there's a higher chance on no. Much higher. I would say... Because we're only doing 25 cleaners, I would say that there is an extremely high chance compared to yes. So, no should have a around a 90% chance of winning, if not higher. Why do I feel like I've played this one before? Well, awkward, but sure. Okay, at least it's not too blind, I guess. Play unclear bubbles for 30 minutes. Is that the one, Fox? Is that the one you're doing? I forgot about the clear. Well, I guess we're playing this now. Uh, okay, so you want me to drop down and go on this and do something like this. Is this worth it? Uh, we're team jam for a minute. I don't think so. He's in jail. Well, you know what? If we don't see one by the end of the endless set, the prediction does say today. And I usually say an endless or a random unclear level is usually how it goes. But for the sake of we didn't know if Fox is going to show up or not, oh, I should have survived that. Do I even want that? I feel like we don't count the uncleared levels in the prediction because Fox wasn't here at the very beginning. I didn't have enough space to write endless because we only get 45 characters when we're making predictions for anyone wondering. Which is kind of lame. I wish we had like a 75 or 100. I don't know why I'm staying in the water, by the way. I can just go up, but I feel like there's a thwomp coming up soon. Wouldn't be super expert without a thwomp, you know. Or not. Also, you can... Probably easily do that without the clown car, but the clown car makes that super free. We're gonna see one because Bryson bet 230,000. Yeah, probably. I'm guessing there's an on off switch behind that saw blade. Also, skillful platformer. Yeah, okay. Let's just make the level much harder, you know? Looks like a job for you. Oh, come on. Wait, no, I was supposed to wait. What? Huh? Skillful platformer means don't go fast. It means go slow. 45 seconds, all right. No extra trolls? No? Alright, moving on. How am I today? I'm actually doing pretty good, I will say. It has to be a triple stack Bowser in a row. That is where the quote comes from. If we see a triple stack Bowser, but there's a boom boom in between some of them, then it does not count, sadly, sorry. We can see a triple stack Bowser in any part of the enemy stack. 
as long as it's three in a row, big or small, doesn't matter. We've, we've seen a double small and one big for, or was it double, one, one small, one double big? I don't remember what it was. As long as it's in a row, anywhere in the stack, it counts. Pre preferably, I would like to see it as a single triple stack, but. Am I gonna die? I don't... This is probably safe, right? Okay, it is. Oh, I'm dead. That sucks. I could do this, I guess. Why not? We'll give it one more try. A very interesting way to zoom in the level. Usually people drop you and you have to start from the bottom. This one makes you go up. Very weird. Also, there's a checkpoint. Should I be ducking when I go down there? Probably. I probably should just be ducking. Okay, the reason why I did that is because that cannonball was going to get in the way later on. If you let go of your hover at any point when you're ducking, you let go of your duck, I'm pretty sure. Let me double check. Okay, as long as you're not... Okay, if you're holding down, it's fine. Never mind, I had to die for no reason. But if you, yeah, if you let go of hover, yeah, let's go to your duck. But if I'm holding down... Okay, as long as I'm holding down... What if I let go of... Let me try something here. What if I let go of down and then down again? Okay, as long as I'm pressing down when I let go of hover, I'm safe. And it's very min maxy of a tech, but it does exist. Also, this level has a glitch in it, which is this right here, so. so as long as I'm holding down, it should be fine. But I should be fine regardless. He said that as he twirls, like, uh, grab his run button again. I don't think run matters here, but I could be wrong. I wasn't ducking there. I feel like I would have died. That is so sad. What a troll. I'm pretty sure that one up is gone because it's a pit, right? No, there's no pit down there. That's a little pit, huh? I don't want to find out. I'm going to go back. Same thing. Oh, I disagree. I wholeheartedly disagree with that hitbox. On my screen, I didn't get hit. I don't know what you're talking about, Nintendo. Wait, why did I go in? Holding right conundrum, I guess. Does this not give you a cape? Oh, it does. All right, I was gonna say. If you go in the door without a cape, do you just die? I guess you can go back down into the door if you're fast enough, huh? Yeah, you die, basically. Wow. Well. Thanks for staying in up mode because I didn't press down. I agree with that one, sadly. You know, I think it's better just to get out of here. This is not a very good endless level, it's just gonna keep eating lives. It really is a showcase to the elevator, I agree. Is this even Kaizo? 
More like, am I playing a hard level that's hard to read? 54 seconds? Eh, I'm good. That question about Buck there is just to make the level harder. I'm good. I figured I'd give it one try. See how far I can get. Turns out I would bonk on the question mark blog. I shouldn't play it. It's a hashtag DGR level and there are multiple ways to do things. And then we have a King Luka level, which is probably an instant skip, but let's see. Oh, I see. Well, it doesn't really matter regardless. There was no... I don't think there's any lineup there at all. The point of that was nothing, I guess. I don't know. I guess you can line up on the hard block and then it drops you into the trump jump. That's just the hunch based on what I see there. But I wasn't going to do it anyways, so. They're a flying level. Conveyor speed pulled me back into the icicle. God, I hate that. I don't know why that's even in the game, Nintendo. I was holding right the whole time, by the way. When I was flying, and I couldn't move because of the conveyor speed pulling me back. Hey, Tobira. Wait, am I actually awake? I've been streaming this time for the last week or so. Oh, it's so difficult. No wonder why I skipped it. Or I played it. I think I cleared it on the, like, the third go. If I remember correctly, I died also there as well. Never trust Twitch notifications. Always trust Discord ones, Tobira. Oh. I think long jump does work there, but there's no indicator, so I have to do a regular jump to do my own thing. I hit the ceiling. One last try and I gotta move on. God! Freaking 3D world charging speed is so annoying. If you're on the ground for too long, it makes you slower. I need to be hopping there is the problem. I'm not fully warmed up. I I jumped though. Is there a hidden block there? I'm just gonna move on. Wait. That is a very, very, very tight world record. And if it's a hold right one, I gotta do it. It's, honestly, holding right in something you can't see is very unfair. Aren't they just called boo rings? Revolve level. I gotta skip. They're usually not good for endless. Yes. Only, only pay attention to Discord notifications. Or YouTube, I guess. But even YouTube ones don't really tell you anything. Too bad. I have a feeling it's gonna get harder though. I wouldn't like it so early. You never know what can end a level. So far, it's good, though. Huh? Why are there arrows on the door? You removed those. Fair enough. 
Those arrows on the door actually made me more confused. I wish I had got that one up a well. Oh, there's a thing. That explains... The... the arrow on the slope and the coins is what got me confused. Remove that arrow, please. The coin trail is good enough. It's making me, like, stutter and, like, uh, what do I do? Rather than following the indicators, I should just play my own level, honestly. Because the indicators don't help very much anymore. That's the only one that helps. Too many confusing things in this level. I'm good. Should have trusted it a little bit more, but at the same time, too many arrows, too many indicators. Either pick an arrow or a coin trail. That's all you need. Yeah, I've been rank one for over half a half, uh, month right now. So I'm just... Huh? Am I not supposed to hit this guy? What? Why are there blue platforms? I guess as you're trying to be nice to the player? Hey, uh, Yoshi. They care about their aesthetics a little bit at least. Don't make me stressed out, come on. Let's go and jump over it. Oh my lord! First he was a friend, now he's not a friend? What is that? Pretty coin is just a troll. Get it out of here. Get that garbage out of here, man. If they were red, it'd be fine. But it wasn't a red bomb, it was muncher bombed. Persona! Fuck and Thiskel cheered with 2,000 bits. What will the wheel gods give me today, Fox and 2 lol? Will they, what will they give you? Probably nothing. But you never know. I could go get that Yoshi 250s and a key, but I have a high suspicion that it is a troll and I shouldn't even bother. Eh, too much speed. Cool, thanks. Also, thanks for the 2000 bits, Fox. I'm hoping that you get at least something out of it, but don't expect it. I mean, at least one bit is 100 rupees regardless, so... You know, you're not getting nothing out of it regardless if you care about that. Although bits and subs should never be like, you're expecting something in return. I just gave it because I'm a nice guy, you know? I try to give bonuses, like, eventually you could just buy your own sub, I guess, if you spend enough. Which, with 2,000 bits, 100 times that, right? 200,000 rupees, I think, right off the bat? Third of a sub right there. And by watching the stream as a sub, you can get one easily within a month for free, so... Keep in mind. I don't have to do any of that, but I do it anyways, because it's fun. 
I think bundles is a really a fun, neat idea. You know. Not going for that again. Oh, I can go for it now for free? Really? Or not. Nope. Got a little greedy, I admit. <laughs> so they're on tracks. So that makes a lot more sense. Ugh. Well, I can get the 30 now that I've died several times. I don't want to go get that Yoshi now. Because I know I can make that jump. This is probably the most boring part of the level right here. It's easy as long as you're paying attention. Persona! Oh gosh. Fucking this skull cheered with 2,000 bits. Wait, I should expect something besides good content from you, Fox and Too Low. Oh, uh, what? What do you mean? Yeah? Yeah? How about that, huh? Let me get one of those. Well, that enemy's gonna be in the way. Oh, unless I get a bone. Hold on. Give me that bone. Oh. He's any racks. I haven't seen you in a while. Anyways. Oh, no, no, no Yoshi's safe, sadly. The creator just hates Yoshi so much. You're just not allowed to have Yoshi. Also, I think I know this is probably a troll, but just in case, we'll do that. But I've gone back for a fire Persona! flower. Fucking this gold cheered with 1,000 bits. That cheese stinky cheese. It was pretty good cheese. I'm glad it wasn't a soft lock. Fox, you hit 1,000 bits and 2,000 bits from before. Thanks for the 5,000 bits. How about that? Hopefully this is not going to be annoyingly tough. I can't go faster in it, so what am I supposed to do? Jump on him? Oh. Alright. Well, now I get a Yoshi. I think we're going to do something like this. And also, we gotta make sure we get both of the Yoshis over here. They're important. Oh, sorry, there's three Yoshis. Uh, oh, well, that sucks. You haven't been playing Mario Maker too much. I'm not surprised, a lot of people have quit out on it. You guys saw nothing. That egg didn't just like explode and nothing came out of it. Why a badge is not showing up anymore? I don't know. I don't know what's causing that. And I refreshed it multiple times and did nothing. I, I can refresh it again and see if it works now. It worked the last time I did this, but let's see. All right, this is a long speed run, but let's do those. <laughs> Fucking this gold cheered with 5,000 bits. Happy birthday, Roy Fox and two hype. I was just going to say, let's do the five spins for Fox, but let's do the ten spins for Fox. Thank you for the 5,000 bits, Fox. Why are you being so generous today? What? Is there a game you really want me to play or something? Is that why you're doing this? Because usually you're not this generous unless it's like a subathon or like a, a, real, a reason to do that. You were generous before that, but then you stopped. So, all right. Let's just get your ten spins in. Oh, now it's just teasing you. Hello, Samuel. Fox, let's see, 75k, there you go. Rupee shower. I mean, every people get rupees as well. Uh, is that not working? Hello? Bot? I guess I'll just do another spin and see if it works or not. Yeah, I didn't think so. Let's try it again. And then we got 25k for you. Why is the all rupee things not working? I don't... What do you mean error occurred? Is there like some sort of thing going on with my channel? Try it again. 
I don't understand why it has an error. If I do it right afterwards, does it work? Okay, well, I guess we owe 26000 so far to chat, and I can't give it for some reason. But I can give it directly, that's crazy. Also, Fox, you have so many rupees, what the heck? It's exclamation point R, or rupees. You spelled rupees wrong, though. Uh, 25,000 as well. I'm gonna try the all rupees thing here after the final one to see if I can get it to work. So apparently it's not working for some reason. Oh, you're actually getting pretty lucky today with the 100,000 twice. Okay, that's 26,000. Can I at least get one of them to work? Okay, there we go. Now we can do this, right? Okay, now it's just now it's gonna have problems. All right, that's fine. I owe three thousand. Oh, three one thousands. Eight thousand now. Does that work? No. No. Okay. <laughs> what do you mean? Come on, give give the rupees to chat. Why are you being a butt? Oh my lord. Okay, I'll just do it when I get a chance. How about that? Also sad that Fox didn't get anything other than rupees. But he got better than he did yesterday, to be fair, though. How tight is this? 37? 37 is what? 120 plus 37, so 150. Uh, we got a little bit of extra time. Oh, I could grab that. I'm gonna grab that. Hold on. We got a little bit of extra free time. Okay, the goal is not in the brick blocks at least. If it was, I was a little bit concerned. I've already lost. Especially if it's a lap level. Unless I can bring the shelmet with me somehow. That would be insane. I can't bring the show with me. It's not possible. Dad. I don't think I have enough time. That was too much, you know, looking for a way out of the level. So, I got here in 16 seconds left. I basically have to get 16 seconds. I need to hit any of those. Yeah. Alright, let's just restart. I was gonna lose anyway, but we got this. Alright, let's try the 8,000 again. Yeah, it's having trouble for some reason. Again, I'll keep trying until it lets me. I don't know why I can't fetch the list. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> 
Alright, top first. The middle, then bottom. That almost killed me. Okay, that's the first fail so far in this run. Let's hope that it's the only fail I get. It won't tell you that you joined. You just have to assume you joined. Flat levels are boring unless you change it up. Alright, let's try it again. There we go. Alright, everyone got their 8,000 rupees. Bosh rush, 8 minutes 40 seconds tells me there's a checkpoint in the level. Cool. Alright. I'll take that over and then taking damage. Cool. It's really calming for some reason, Cynical. I mean, I'm not really generally loud unless I get upset about a level that is very disappointing. But other than that, I'm pretty chill. You know? Again, I'll take a freebie instead of taking damage, so thank you for that. Spamming enough for a. It's not spammy enough for a triple stack Bowser. I mean. You're not wrong! But at the same time, hey, you never know. It might happen anyways. Maybe the reason why it took the full record holder 8 minutes and 40 seconds because there's a triple stack. Who knows? I'm kind of low on lives. 66, what do you mean? That's two thirds of the life pool. Low is like 50s or under, that's half of your life pool. I don't know how to hit him, but I'll take it. Balls? What is going on? Okay. That's definitely better, thank you. Oh man, five mil to zero. He's just, oh. Well, use it responsibly, you know? Don't just spam. It's 
slots or something. Because slots rates are... Actually, you know what? Wait, are slots normal right now? I better double check on the rates right now. I don't know if I changed it from last night or not. Ooh, look at that. I didn't. It was on Zelda rates. Good thing I just noticed, because otherwise it would have been really bad. Alright, fixed now. I rigged the slots and gamble a little bit further. Maybe one of those pies has a developer exit, who knows. Ooh, you can make one of your slots and don't take damage. I can do it though. I also have to play it very safe. Them making lives? I don't think so. We'll see. I doubt most people will keep their acorns here, but well, you never know. Oh. Well, maybe you're right. I was expecting a Bowser fight, a Boom Boom, and a Bowser Jr. What happened? It's a very bland boss rush, so I'm gonna leave it as a neutral despite the two checkpoints. And there was a way to make one ups on your own, but it would be better if you just hand them out, you know? At least maybe there were some hidden ones I didn't find, but at least give one at the end, minimum. Impossible. Yeah, I look, these are levels I like to play, I enjoy them. But an endless I mean, I'm gonna die regardless. Yeah, well, I sh They think the, the level's impossible. There's gonna be trolls everywhere. I'm good. Those are levels I really like to play, but if I was not, like, if I was at, in the 80s, maybe I would've given that first try, but... Probably shouldn't touch it. that for a one-up. Why is there so many hidden blocks, though? That's what I want to know. It's worth it, but the hidden block BS needs to go away. Only to maintain rank? I mean, yeah. I can play for fun out of Endless if I die once. I have things I want to do today. So, you know, I'm kind of on a time budget right now. And dying to a muncher because I'm trying to get coins is not a good way to show that.
All right, you know, that's fine. I was gonna go back and get the other one up, but... What? As if I was supposed to know that's there. Uh-oh. Is that bad or good? I mean, that might have been good. But probably bad. Well, I got a time limit looks like there, maybe? I don't know. Might have been a good thing for me. Maybe. It actually was a good thing for me. What the heck? The spike ball exploding was the best thing that could have ever happened. Nice. You wonder how I do on no skip runs? My record for no skip is 23, and that's like the... I don't know how many hours I put into it. Maybe like a good 30, maybe, in my total time playing My Maker. Well, not today, because there's already been a card played for uncleared levels today, so. Tomorrow will be a better time to do that. kind of annoying. A lot of pl platform momentum in this level. Oh, my thousand plus is an expert, yeah. My super expert no skip is 23. I find it more fun to play skips. Because I get to make the content I want to make. Rather than me forced into not skipping. And making content out of no skip it means you have to show every level. Otherwise it's not gonna look good. And some levels are just so bad for content, it's just hard, you know. Oh I do remember this level! This is the hardest jump right here. Oh, man. I don't know if they've got a re-upload or... I played on my alt or something. I guess we're gonna find out. Yeah, just because Moon Moon made a uh, Moon Moon a notorious skipper. I saw Moon Moon play Mario Maker for the like what two weeks he played it for. Either it's a re-upload or I just never gave it a a rating. And I'm still gonna keep it as neutral. Yeah, the record for no skip is 44 by Orator. That was early in the game's life though, like 2019 or early 2020. Six minutes long, you have a door on the edge. This is not good. I mean, there's time to react to that. I'm just bad. Seven minutes for a level like this. That is a skip. Probably means there's a checkpoint, and the second part is really hard. Way more time in two weeks? Mm, I mean... Pretty sure it was like two or three weeks, right? Then he went and moved on to a different game. Pretty sure. And that's when I noticed him. I knew about him, I just didn't know he played Mario Maker. Uh, sure.
Wow, I got pretty lucky. Or not, because this level is an ass. What is that door drop? This is getting a boo now. And Morphin was, what, around 42, 43, I would say. You had a huge phase this year. I've, how? Look, all right. Clearly, you know more about Moo Moo. I don't really watch him that much. But when he's playing Mario Maker, someone told me about it, and I started watching him, all right? Within those two or three weeks that he played that I saw, you know, he you was skipping quite a bit, yeah. Leaving. Anyways. Before I get distracted. Squirrel can't get that, I don't think. I think I have to do a small wall jump to survive. All right, well, I'm gonna boo it no matter what. So here we go. All right, now that we did that, do this. Clearly the server doesn't want me to boo it. That's fine. And let's go beat it. You can't go over. It's not low gravity, guys. Come on. However, there might be something hidden. Very possible. But more than likely, you have to spam wall jump and not die to the spikes. Yeah, you really think you can get over that? I don't think so. That's awful, man. I wasn't even holding left. I just tapped it and I died. Maybe I gotta do a right wall jump there? I'm not sure how that works. Oh, it is a white wall. I tap left, my character goes to the right, and all of a sudden I die to the spike on the left. That doesn't make any sense, Nintendo. Okay, I needed to go big jump there. I wasn't sure how they wanted it. Does Z7 and Morpha not go for one-ups in their big runs? Let's keep this up. Oh, oh my god, a two-gapper? Okay, before I do that, let me see if they cheese their own level. Hold on. A two-gap, one-block height spike way it is not easy. I wonder why this is unclear. I think it would fully deserve the boot regardless now. Also, uh, Skippy, you think you would find months looking back. Yeah, big jump. Uh, it is legit. That's what I was worried about. I don't think I've ever done that jump before successfully. Let me check something. Let me see how to do it. Yeah, or it doesn't go out of his way for sure. But I figured the other two would have gone out of the way for that. We're just testing the jump. If it seems like I can do it, then I'll do it. If it's something I can't do, I'm not gonna bother. I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on it, is what I'm saying. I think you have about this much distance before you make that? I guess we're gonna find out. Here we go. Oh, I should probably finish up the little route first. That would be smart. Yeah. Let's just assume... Oh no, I can't make it unless I do this. Here we go. Oh, that's actually not that hard. As long as I get the twirl, it should be free. The problem is getting the twirl in a one gap. 
because the game has very specific parameters of getting that. Oh, I didn't have to even twirl, and I, I pressed the button too, wow. You made it. I mean, I guess at least they gave out three one-ups despite what they put in the level. Nope, wrong button. Hey look, Males is playing Tears of the Kingdom, how about that? <laughs> God dang it, Duke. <laughs> yeah, time to twirl. It seems like you've been watching a lot of Star Rail, huh? I would use Herda if she actually wasn't nerfed so hard from the CBT. I guess we just wait. I'm very surprised there wasn't spikes behind the goal. Only because this plays it. I mean, yeah. I play it too, but I don't play it on stream very often. Mostly because there's like no content at the moment. Meh. If that was the only trick, maybe. It looks like a either a shell jump from afar or a shell toss to land on it later. Hey look, a Bowser. Sure. Also, where's the buzzer? Buzzy shot. Oh. Okay. <laughs> all right. Again, where's the shellman? That's all. Wait, how many seconds was that, by the way? Ten? Okay, that was only ten. That's not good. Can I just go on top? What's stopping me from doing so? Oh my god, I jumped into him like a dumbass. I saw an obstacle and I jumped and I shouldn't have. Oh. That's 20 seconds right there, so where's the shellman? I think I'm gonna have to skip it. I still don't see the shellman. I can't play the level if I don't see it. No, I can't have triple stack Bowser potential because it's only one world. Not play it if you have no indicators for that. If you already have one Bowser in the main world, you can't have three on the same uh, stack. It's not possible, sadly.
No, I missed the final shell jump. That sucks. I did everything well until the final one. It's easy to make a shell jump as long as there's no scrolling. Oh, I did it again. As long as there's no scrolling screen up and down. For some reason, it always throws me off. That's because the desert music is really good. Unless you mean the fanfare at the end, then yeah. I can't even believe I one shot did that. There were so many instances where a spike should have hit me. I'm also surprised my grandpa and cancel actually went through because I'm still using the old controller. By the way, I did purchase a new controller, but I have to wait about a week to get it. No, how level? Oh, everything was starting to line up because they were out of sync, and then all of a sudden, I grabbed it because I was <laughs> it wasn't realizing how big of a jump I needed to make. Oh my lord! Oh nope, it's it's a Kaizo. I thought it was gonna be a pow level. Nope. I'm out of here. I use Ahoy Procon. If you guys look at the About Me section and go down to my gear, you'll get in any information you want. You know that, right? Like, it, it's there. Most streamers probably don't put information like that in their... Uh, I'm good on this. In their, you know, About Me section, but it's there. If you want it, it's all there. Supposed to hit that on off? No, it doesn't matter, it looks like. Is there a vine there? What the hell? Crazy? Yo, why is there a vine there? I'm just gonna go over here. I can spin jump there, it's fine. I'm just worried that I need the on off later. How are you supposed to dodge? I guess you're supposed to just wait. I had to push it. I don't think it was going to hit the wall regardless. Nothing I could have done there either, other than what I did. Oh, that's right. We were doing Toadette. Sorry, I forgot. Luigi doesn't want to break. He knows what he can do. That should make it. Oh. 
No, I heard it. I just forgot. I mean, wouldn't I forget too if I didn't want to actually play as Toadette? You know, maybe I should have just taken damage. Might have been a better idea. Luigi is never found again. He's in the pit forever. Dude, I could have gotten that. I guess it doesn't matter. Uh, that matters. Uh, I should not load those anymore. That door is probably not worth it, by the way. I don't see any use to that door. Uh... That's awkward. Bro, why did you give me a mushroom? What is wrong with you? There's something up there though. Giving me a mushroom was the worst mistake. Clearly you didn't use it. The only way you could have used this mushroom is on the door. And even then, I don't believe you. Is that a pal, you think? Probably. That door is a death door. Look at that. We just saw it. I do need some one-ups. That is very nice. At least they gave out one mushroom. Acorn as well. Very interesting. But well, actually kind of helped by throwing that. That's for the deaf door. Yeah, they kind of gave up at the end. At least it didn't kill me, I guess. I would have booted if it did. I knew it. I knew it. I was like, you know, it's going to be a dropper, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And of course, they hit you with the time to die moment. Oh. I get punished for going to the left. That's my problem with that. When it's a whole, you know, you have to dodge them anyway, so why would you do that to the player? Oh, that's right, it doesn't matter because you know everything about the level. So I need to be on the furthest one. I've already died three times on this level, by the way. Despite it being short. No checkpoint, no power ups, no one us. Very normal level, I'm super expert. Maybe 
Maybe I wait. Maybe waiting is better there, I don't know. Probably not going to wait because I could care less. I'll just do that because it's safer. No trolls? That's a big yikes moment. Ah, right, the lava makes it go slower. That's fine. If I would have remembered that, I wouldn't have died there. Surely you'll get three one-ups at the end, right? Surely. It's a very big copium moment. Surely you'll give out three one-ups, right guys? Surely. I somehow basically tied the world record on the same second. If I wouldn't have, you know what? They also looked out for one-ups too. That kind of makes sense. I think I did that right, but I gotta go a little bit faster. Oh, I'm above the goal. That makes more sense. So then I do a jump and I go in the goal. Wow, no one is either on this level. Awesome. At least you get the goal one, I guess, if you're lucky. But that's only if you're lucky. There's no timing on that one. Almost had it, though. You know, Fox, you should make that as your alt. Fox and the socks. Probably gonna, yeah, it's not gonna be worth it. We run trash, at least they're, you know, admitting what they made. God, this really is trash. Why is there a down arrow? Figured you'd be facing the other way, but that makes sense. It is trash, they're not lying, but if there's too many infractions, I'm gonna... Have to... Oh my god, I was so... Like, I was paying attention to up and left. I didn't even think he'd come over and kill me, Jesus. But I should've expected it, because the first one did. I was looking for one-up potentials. What do you mean, uh-uh? Oh, that's what you mean by uh-uh. Well, at least he said, you know what, you know it's trash. You know what, and I know it, so let's just die, I guess. Dodge that. The troll. If you what? Wait, how am I? Oh, wait. Wait, I've been doing this wrong. Oh. 
Like that? That might be cheese. Really is trash, huh? And then I die instantly out of the door. No? So I'm supposed to do this? Well, at least I beat it in three attempts or something like that, huh? Has the algorithm been any better than normal? It's been about normal. Yeah, I guess they were kind of lenient with the timer, but I realized what I did wrong in the level because it was it's a puzzle speedrun, basically. And luckily I was able to save it by throwing the power at the right spot. Oh, uh, I'm good. Don't know why they have a clear condition for that level other than maybe a lot of spikes on the level. So many unclear levels today though, that is definitely new. Oh, I'm... I'm dead because I didn't trust the level. Dude, how are you supposed to know where to drop? That's just so unfair. It's a dropper with a clear condition that makes it more unfair. I'd rather have spikes, I guess, than a clear condition fail. She just jumped over. I didn't think it'd have a parachute. A troll level or a real level? What is going on? Looks like I gotta get all the keys. For the hotel. Uh, probably easier if I wait for down now. Why is the first one so much harder than all the other ones? Oh my god, it scared the shit out of me. What do you guys shoot? Points? Oh, that's actually what I want. I guess I already shot once. Suddenly music level? So the keys don't- Oh, the keys are trolls? Maybe? I'm not sure what the keys are for then if they were never worth it in the first place. I didn't see that. I was so focused on the cannons not shooting anything for some reason. Ugh. Bro, the second time you go through the freaking music level, it's so much harder, what? I mean, there has to be three T doors in the level, right? Just shoot him, please. What am I supposed to do? Oh, get all the keys. That's actually kind of an interesting design. Wait a minute. The 
Boom Boom doesn't matter? Alright. Nah, should just, the level should just been this in the first place. It would've been much more fun to play. Interesting level, though. No one wants to play your music level every single time we die. Please. Imagine not giving out a power up to make your life a little bit easier, you know? My alerts broke? I don't know what you mean by that. Yeah, I had no idea the keys affected the first one, by the way. It wasn't obvious, basically, that's the problem, because I didn't check the right side first. Oh, I thought I died there. You know, I can get that with a running start. Would prefer a bomb, but sure. Wait, Super Balls or Oregon? Sound effects? I didn't even know that. An actual good use for them. Oh god. Thanks for the music. So am I supposed to go with... I is this actually bait or can I actually go and get that? I don't think I can get that, can I? I guess I can. Wow. Okay, let's get rid of the issues first. Actually, let's just go in the door. Problem solved. I can see where the key doors come into play now. But what do you mean my alerts broke, by the way? You didn't even answer my question, Duke. I refreshed the cache. I can't do anything more than that, though. Yes, it went. It went off. I, I heard it. I didn't, I didn't look over to see it, but I heard it. There's no way to save that. Thanks. No, the icons are different from the alerts. They're two different things. I really don't like the mix of yellow spikes in between this stuff. If they're wall jumps, that's fine. But when they're not wall jumps, they're not fine. No way you just did that to me. Why? There is no point in doing that.
He can just live up there for some reason. You can have it on the other way, by the way. Just do it. But I do have to do a long jump here. I think I skipped it last time I got this in Endless. I saw that I already played it. Pretty sure I just died and moved on. Why do it the other way, though? Is it easier? Uh, if you can make that jump, it's easier. Oh my god. Wait, no way. Now, let me guess. The ending is gonna kill me. Yeah, you earned your boo. I'm out of here. Where am I? Am I gonna play this? I mean... Looking at the world record, I think I'm already at the end. Alright, fine. I was gonna skip it, but I'll play it again. It's my own fault for cheesing it that way, but... Just make an automatic hit, rather than make the player hit it. What is that jump? It's insanely, like, long. I'm getting punished for going too fast. I thought this level was straight to the point. What happened? This requires a lot of puzzle thinking here. In the sense, like, what is actually safe and what isn't, you know? If you hit the ceiling, you die. Okay, no, I should have skipped when I did. If you hit that ceiling, you just die. You, you gotta make a big jump there anyway, so... If you make it too small, you die. If you make it too big, you're dead. It's not a fair level. You think they wanted a ground pound cancel? You know, you're probably right, and I didn't see it because, again, it's straight to the point. If they wanted a ground pound cancel, they wouldn't have made their title that way. But yeah, ground pound cancel does kind of make sense. Although I have been avoiding ground pounds if I can. Because my controller has down drift and sometimes my ground pound cancels don't come out. I don't know if I'm supposed to go under or. Oh, I see cheese. Unless that's coins. I could grab one of those if I really wanted to. Are these coins? No. <laughs> they're not coin blocks. They're they're actually regular turn blocks that turn into coins. Awesome. Ugh. That is some great A level design right there. Now I kind of want to cheese the level. Let me look. 56 seconds. I'll keep that in mind. Play it legit for now. But the wait time is kind of bull, you know? chance to look around at least, I guess. You were meant to do this because each pit in here is a soft lock, almost guaranteed. But I'm like pretty sure that you can cheese this level. But I need lives now, so I can't really be thinking that. Or maybe not. Maybe you can't cheese it. No, you can't. Never mind, I'm glad I chose this route, but however, the ending is... Oh, it's a bit sad. Unless I can make that jump. I can make that jump. Probably should boo it for that. Too late now. Play the clear condition? I don't know. People play the clear condition because they don't want to put a checkpoint. That's usually what it is. Uh, okay, alright. I guess I'm over here. I live here now. 
<laughs> oh man, these triple jump setups though. Auto scroll, don't jump. Very interesting design. I feel like I already lost, but we'll see. Maybe not, I guess we're fine for the most part. That's cool. Very, very cool. practicing if I want to play this or not. I should just take taken damage. It made more sense. Apparently, you still have a mushroom here. Putting these coins. Am I meant to keep something here, or is it just get, that, uh, get past the monks? All right, no trolls. Play it again. We'll be able to get hopefully a plus one off of it. The don't jump clear conditions should be changed, like I've always said. It should just disable your jump button rather than letting you jump, you know, instead. That's how I feel about it. Why is there an extra, like, piece switch here? Oh, I guess for the up throws, I guess, yeah. But apparently you're supposed to lose it at this point? Not really sure. That way, if it disables your jump button, you can hold down the jump button to get big jumps off of enemies if you're not supposed to jump. That would have been a much better design. I see my issue. Well, we might as well get more coins while we're here. So I'm meant to just go fast there. I gotta stop thinking about my safety rather than... All right, let's get these coins, and then let's play again. We should be able to get, again, a plus one if I get enough coins this time. I'm hoping anyways. So, that big buzzy thing, let it fall down it as soon as possible. Run away from it. Take damage, but not from under, otherwise you'll die. Okay, got it. Actually, yeah, you can stop the shell with the switch, but I don't know if you're supposed to. I guess you can slide down to kill all the other enemies. You do get a POW, so... Yeah, you can do multiple different ways. I just chose to go slow, and therefore I, I got punished. To be fair, though, I kind of expected that. Do I even need the mushroom? The second mushroom is probably what you're supposed... Well, I don't know. to the buzzy we just keep going go fast because auto scroll is really bad in this level let's go fast go we'll try that suggestion might as well it does work so that's cool. God, look how fast you have to be that's so unfair
Well, at least we have a mushroom this time. If that means anything. Yeah, the problem was I wasn't sure if I needed the P-Switch later, but yeah, you're right. Since we don't really need the P-Switch later, we can just drop it down. It's no big deal. Could have one-shotted that level if I didn't get bopped by the Buzzy. Maybe. What do you mean, no like, Sag? Of course it's not going to get a like. The level's brutal on the auto-scroll. Especially in that one section when you're climbing up, and you can get hit by the buzzy from down below. That's really unfair. If they were consistent in their auto school level design, I might have actually liked it. Indicators? No. Maybe. Actually, there might be indicators. No progressive. You don't get rewarded for being a good player. Down below to catch you in case you fall. But I don't know how important that is. Why did he have. Okay. Didn't have no wings for some reason, sure. Maybe you're trying to throw the player off or something, I don't know. throws me off every single time. I was not ready for that. Gotta go. Otherwise, I'm gonna die. Stop it! Not cool, man. Put wings on those guys, please. There's more? Or is there a bonus up here? There's something. Oh, you put that block up there so that level has I see. get five on the screen. Yeah, I don't think you can get five on the screen. Here, Ophelius. I don't know. I don't know why you're so interested about that topic, Kraken. Greetings are greeting. I mean... When someone says greetings, I feel like it's for multiple people. When someone says greeting, I feel like it's like, I don't know how you use greeting. I feel like greetings is the only way to say it, and then greeting is like, trying to explain something about it. Also, why does this not have a muncher on it? Thank you. 
Well, at least we can go down here. Wait, are you just gonna allow me to blue my way out? Bro, what is that? I could have made one of the peace switch on the side of a wall. Why? Why am I ruining your level like that? What the hell? Well, there goes my one-up potential right here I was gonna do, or over here. On this wall, I could've made one-ups. But no, you just have to kill the player, all right. There's some coins over there, but how does that... Oh, I see. I wasn't ready. I see how to do it, though. They have a GG and a THX in their level. Yeah, you deserve it. Enough time? Probably is, right? Another THX? How many TH TX uh how many THXs do you freaking need? Jeez. Can I go back the other way? Probably not. Dude, they don't want you to get a freaking one up either. I got it, barely. Also, I noticed the one way just stopped moving during that. And thanks for the 50 coin that you couldn't even give me earlier. Ugh. Like, saying it like, it's a greeting. I mean, you're trying to explain what that person said. You're using greeting instead. It says right path of trolling precision. I don't... It has trolls in it. I'm not playing it. <laughs> if how I may have given the one-ups. What do you mean? There wasn't enough munchers on screen, if that's what you were saying. I actually remember this level. Kind of brutal. Trying to play it safe. Uh, and that's another death that I took, I think, last time, too. Yeah, you need, I think, eight enemies with a pal. Minimum to get one one up. Nine is two, and ten is three. On a flagpole, you just need five. Five, six, and seven. I don't know why, but that's just how it's designed from Nintendo. I feel like I'm getting edged on a factor. Well, at least now I get it every time I die, so it's fine, I guess. level, though, I think the reason why I didn't like it is because all the artificial difficulties in the level, you know, make it harder to like. But it is a pretty good level, I'll admit. You know what? I think my first attempt at this level made me not want to like it, but I'm going to give it a like now. After seeing the level twice. I think I skipped it. I don't think I beat the level. Yikes. I guess it's not that bad. The first coin I'm a little scared about, but since you can touch the wall there, it's fine. This 
obstacle here. Are those three one-ups? Wow. But, I don't, wait, hold on, I missed some coins though. Cause there's like, what, only six here, if that's possible? Yeah. I think the up arrow means that's where I missed it. When I understand. Can I even go back? If I can. I don't know if it's safe to go down there or not. I forget. It is, okay. Thank god. You know, I'll give this one a like. You can go back and get that last coin. It was clearly indicated with an arrow, but I didn't see. I assume the arrow was for, you know, getting over to the right side. Four seconds? Oh, it's a it's a triple jump put on the hat bubble. That's all it is. Didn't I just see this level earlier today from Casper? I think I did. I'm not gonna play it. Probably don't have all this time to. Well, I mean, there's that, so. What? Am I supposed to drop the pal? What is this? If I toss the pal, does something different happen? Only the bottom goes away. What the f- What is this? I think you just gotta drop the pal. And then jump off of it. That's the only thing I can think of. Or we don't, you know- <laughs> Or maybe you just jump on the clouds and just do a big jump instead, because that's actually what's required. Well... Uh-oh. Uh... I, I think I have to do mid-air Yoshi tongues? That's the only thing I can think of as well. I'm gonna have to skip this here, one more death. It's unclear for a reason. Dude, I want to just YOLO to the right. I desperately want to do that. Bowser fight. Well, sorry, Yoshi. I guess this is how it'd be. Probably still need him. Yep. Unless... Oh, if I would have grabbed him the, a shell there, I would have been fine. Blind fall, of course, onto a saw blade. I should have trusted the level a little bit more, but I saw the, the claw and I just wanted to use it, you know? Yeah, 
You actually can keep Yoshi there. I just thought about that. Yeah, I really could have just kept Yoshi there if I would have grabbed the shell. I'm just gonna take damage because it looks like you have to, anyways. That's the whole level, right? PG? Nice. Let's keep this up. Bird up, thank you for the two months. Welcome back. What do you mean cheating the level? Pausing is part of the actual gameplay. What do you mean? <laughs> I know, right? Pausing is not cheating. The only thing I would even consider cheating is maybe using the one frame pause at the bottom of a pit or dying to save a life. My rule is if I get it by accident or if I time it, I'm allowed to use it. Otherwise, I just, I just don't use it. Although it is built in the game, it's still buggy because the pause apparently doesn't get affected by the buffer in this game for whatever reason. Yikes. Guess we give it one try. Wait, oh, I, I, wait. That cloud, though. That cloud is such a troll. They want you to go fast there. Uh, with that cloud there, I don't have any interest in it. You know, counter argument. Why do creators make blind shit? Of course I gotta pause, you know? Are you supposed to long jump there? Probably. Also, yeah, creators can pause while well, clear could checking as well. That's true. Not like they should pause in their level unless they're trying to make a really difficult level and or need it for themselves, but yeah. I don't think we're gonna see triple stack Bowsers, but eh, we'll see. We'll see. You're eating a lemon? Hey, Flux. Lemons are good. Man, I just assumed I needed to do that. Wow. Wait, why would I do that to myself? Wait, that still counts? What? Falling into a warp box doesn't get rid of your... Huh? That is something I never knew. Checkpoints are cheating because the creators can't use them? I see. Dumb eats the pill though. I have to cut it open if I'm gonna eat a lemon. Wow, I wonder what kind of level this is. I'm surprised that was the right one, but also not surprised because, you know, number three is always right. Bad troll. It's progressive, apparently. I'm not gonna go in any of those pipes. Be safe. Prepare yourself. Wait, am I not supposed to have a? It's showtime. Did I just get trolled? Oh no, I didn't. Oh, we're good. <laughs> get out of here. I thought there was gonna be a don't take damage section where if you have a mushroom, you just lose. But never mind. Oh well, hey, see we got a raid from the one and only Cheese Pops. Welcome in raiders. We just finished this set, which is very unfortunate. But we'll do one more, one more level for the raid, and then I'm gonna swap over to uncleared levels for a little bit. Oh lord. 
grasp your new persona power. We're doing super expert right now, but after this next clear, I'm gonna swap over to uncleared. I guess we're gonna do link and puzzle unclear stuff. I think that's the plan. How was your stream, by the way, Cheese? How good is it? Pretty good today, despite my lives kind of dwindled down a little bit. I had like a good chunk. I think it was in the 80, 70, 80s ish area. But it is what it is. Just a nature super expert. This is a very weird version of blue platforming. I don't think I've ever seen this version before. Usually there's blue platforms everywhere, but they're using orange lifts and stuff like that. You got wrecked. Didn't wait. Didn't know how to do a distance shell jump? You mean what? A long shell jump? That's all it is? Where you jump and then you toss and you have to wait like two seconds to land on it, basically? Oh, great. Found out why it's in Super Expert. Just trying to find some hidden blocks. Maybe I'll get lucky. Never mind, it was free? I put dark in your level then. Also, Lobster, thank you to fight you with gifts. I appreciate that a lot. Wow, that was the, like the easy, well, not really easiest. It was like the, the, the fastest one clear I think I've ever done for a raid. I guess we'll do one more. 77 is a good number. Are you not good at Kaizo, Cheese? You don't think the raid work? What do you mean? I got a plenty of people who... Why, why would you say that? Failing everything? What do you mean? Looks like your record was just broken in Super Expert. Wait, what? I mean, you, you did write into the number one Super Expert uh, endless leaderboard player, so... Hmm... Alright, we'll give it one try. Oh, I didn't see I had to go to the left side. I was looking at the right. That's fine. Fair enough. He held a world record of five super expert clears. If it was on day one, sure. I was not ready for that one either. There's a weird indicator coming up. Might give this a couple more tries. It's pretty fun. I keep missing the first shell jump though, because I'm going for like max height for whatever reason. I don't know why I'm doing that. I should go for a control jump. Oh, it's because I'm looking at the indicator, that's why. I shouldn't be doing that. Oh, that's a big arrow. <laughs> I understand now. There we go. Not bad. I want to avoid playing unclear, so he's playing more super expert. Well, I got to move on to Star Rail at some point, you know. All right, so it was fair on the timer. And the ind indicators are pretty spot on for the most part. It was kind of hard to read on that double shell jump, double single shell jump, you know, to the left and to the right. Kind of hard to read. Three one-ups. The level didn't have anything more than just shell jumps, up throws, reclaims. Yeah, all right. I know, I already said I was gonna do one more. So anyways, I will be right back and then we're gonna do some uncleared. 